Hello, thank you so much for coming back to watch today's video. So today for you, I do have my November empties to share with you. So if you'd like to see some of the products I've gone through and if I would repurchase, then please keep on watching. Uh, just so you know, I do upload a daily video all about budget beauty, so make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. I also do a live stream the majority of Sundays at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So come hang out, come chat with me. I would really love to get to know ya. Okay, so I usually only have um, five products in my empties, but this month I do have seven. So very first one I'll talk about is the Speed Stick Irish Spring Antiperspirant. Oh my gosh. This stuff is amazing. It legit smells like Irish Spring. So I would consider this to be like a unisex um, antiperspirant. I mean, I love the soap, so if you do like um, Irish Spring, I would definitely recommend this. I actually do have a backup of this, so I won't be repurchasing because I already have one, but really, really, really good antiperspirant. It does keep you dry all day long, but really, really good and super affordable, so definitely love it. Um, another thing I've gone through is the Dickinson's Hydrating Toner. This is just a little travel size, but this stuff is amazing. I did a ded dedicated video to this, and I liked it so much. I got this in a Walmart beauty box. Anyway, I liked it so much that I actually bought a full size. Um, like I said, it's alcohol free, there's um, witch hazel, and it just has like a very nice light scent, but it's a really, really good toner. So if you do have dry skin, or normal skin and you don't want something that's too drying, the Dickinson's. Um, the hydrating toner is amazing and I'm so glad I have it. I have been using another toner. It is for anti-aging and like pore clearing and everything. I've been using that for a couple of weeks and oh my gosh, I love that stuff. So let me know down below if you want me to do a video on that toner because it is bomb.com. Okay, so another item I have here is the Pink Honey Blossom Hand Cream. This is a little one ounce tube. I was actually given this as a gift and this is a really, really good hand cream. It smells really, really good. It's very moisturizing. It does have shea butter in it. I personally won't be repurchasing this just because I have a ton of lotions and a ton of hand creams I do need to get through. But if you do like a delicate, kind of warm, scent, I really think that the Honey Blossom um, hand cream is really, really great from Pink. I could even purchase it if I wanted to because our Victoria's Secrets closed down, so sad, but really, really good stuff. Uh, Cellafit um, Double Effect Cleanser Oil to Foam. Oh my gosh. I got this in an Ipsy bag and this stuff is amazing. It's meant for um, dry and sensitive skin. I do have combination skin. I also am, I break out easily, but this stuff is amazing. It's exactly what it says. It goes from an oil to a foam. It removes all traces of makeup and it's just a really nice cleanser. Um, I actually do have a backup of this because they had an add-on or a, anyway, on Ipsy's website and so it came with this and like a little face mask for three dollars so I did did pick up another one of these it's really really good stuff I might need to put on my Christmas list they do have a full size like six ounce bottle um, and it's like $25 but you know me I'm not gonna spend $25 on a on a face cleanser but it's really really good stuff um, if you do have dry sensitive skin you would love this there is a little bit of a scent but it's just so nice. Oh my goodness, really, really good stuff. Um, something I wasn't crazy about. This is the Perlis Blue Lotus 4-in-1 Cleansing Milk. I got this in an Ipsy bag as well. And it's a milky cleanser. There's no foaming, but it's supposed to like remove makeup and it's soap-free and, sul and sulfate-free. I don't know. I just, I feel like it wasn't like super clean rinsing. I didn't like the scent, um, so I just wasn't crazy about this, so yeah, I wouldn't purchase this. It's just not my type of face product, but you, if you like a milky cleanser, you might like the Perlis um, Blue Lotus 4-in-1 Cleansing Milk. It's just, I, I wasn't crazy about it, so yeah. Okay, two products left. I have one makeup item. And it is the L'Oreal Voluminous Feline Mascara. 
if you had watched any of my previous like makeup videos or whatever, like I love this mascara. I love um, all of the L'Oreal Voluminous mascaras I've tried, but the feline, it just gives such pretty volume and length and definition. No smudging, no flaking. The stuff is just awesome and it's all dried out and it's gone. I unfortunately won't be repurchasing it just because I have so many mascaras I need to get through, but yeah, if you're looking for a good, like, non-waterproof mascara that will stay put all day, the L'Oreal um, Voluminous Feline, it's wonderful. Plus, look at that beautiful packaging. Just really, really nice. Love it a lot. And then the last thing, it's kind of a basic product, but it is a tube of Carmex Lip Balm. I very rarely go through lip balm completely, but my lips have been super duper dry. It's been snowing here, it's been in the 30s, so yeah, my lips are super dry. Um, I don't like the way Carmex smells, but it is a really good kind of lip ointment, and it's also great for like elbows and cuticles. You can use it pretty much anywhere you have dry skin, but yeah, I won't be repurchasing, repurchasing this either just because I already have a ton of lip balms and everything, but it's a really nice lip a balm to like really help to soothe dry lips so yeah if you're looking for something that's super affordable definitely recommend the Carmex so in the tube I just I don't like dipping my fingers in pots but really really good stuff so the only thing I wouldn't repurchase um, just because I didn't like it would be the Perlis um, Blue Lotus Cleansing Milk but besides that everything else I absolutely love so there we go, but um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please go ahead and give the video a thumbs up and share it. Let me know down below in the comments what are some things you've gotten through this month. I would love to know down below and whether or not you liked them or not. And just so you know, um, I do have a Macari page where I sell discount makeup, beauty, skincare, hair care, all sorts of stuff. I also have a, another YouTube channel where I upload seven days a week all about budget food. And I also have a little Facebook group where we kind of hang out and chat and post good deals and pictures and stuff. So I'll have them all three linked down below. As well as these products, um, they will be an affiliate link through Amazon. So you're welcome to use it, but you definitely don't have to. But anyway, um, of course, you're always welcome to follow me on my other social media, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's all about your glam, babe. Don't go anywhere quite yet. Another video should start auto playing here very shortly. We can always click on one of the ones that'll be popping up around the screen. But yeah, see you here in just a sec.